2024 is going to see a big makeover for the productivity apps in Microsoft 365. And I think these changes are pretty good. And that's what we're gonna talk about in today's video. But first, just a quick intro. My name is Jonathan Edwards from Integral IT in the UK. We help businesses all over the world with the Microsoft 365. So at the moment, Microsoft offers lots of different applications for you to be able to manage your projects and your tasks. You've got Microsoft To Do, which covers your personal tasks. Then you've got Microsoft Planner, which covers your team projects, tasks, and collaboration. But then within Teams, you've also got something called Tasks by Planner and To Do. It's all a bit of a head scratch. But just a couple of weeks ago at Microsoft Ignite, Microsoft announced a raft of changes for these productivity apps. Now, we're gonna talk about those changes in a moment. But first, what are the problems we're trying to fix? Firstly, part of the problem is there's too many applications to manage different things. Mm. Is this task gonna go in my to-do or is it gonna become a team project and shall I put it in planner? I'm definitely gonna put this in planner. Or am I? What about Microsoft Teams? Should it go in there? Secondly, the to-do and planner applications have been around since 2016. That's a long time in technology and they've never really had any changes or any improvements. And thirdly, a lot of people that I speak to think that Planner is a little bit, well, basic. And what they do when they want to manage more complex projects with more advanced features is they need to go away and buy the old fashioned Microsoft project, which is an extra cost. So it seems that Microsoft have actually listened and they've announced a raft of changes to supercharge your productivity. So what are these changes going to be? Well, the first change is quite subtle and it's gonna happen very soon. Tasks by Planner and To Do within Microsoft Teams is just gonna have a name change. It's gonna be changed to be called just Planner. Nothing else will change at this stage, just the name. The first big change is going to happen in spring 2024. Microsoft To Do, Microsoft Planner, and Microsoft Projects on the web are all gonna to come together to form a new productivity application. And it's just gonna be called Planner. Now at first, this is gonna be available just within Microsoft Teams. And then later in 2024, it will get its very own web app. So what are the features that are gonna be included in this new super duper app called Planner? Firstly, do you remember when I told you that people often got confused because there were too many productivity apps? Well, not anymore. Everything is gonna be rolled into one. You're gonna be able to see all of your tasks across Microsoft 365 in one place. These might be personal tasks. There might be a project that you're part of. It might be a follow-up from a Teams meeting. It might be a, a task from Microsoft Outlook or even from Microsoft Loop. Everything will be joined together in one single plane of glass. Nice and simple. And secondly, we spoke earlier about Planner being too basic for some people's needs. Well, again, Microsoft have listened. Lots of features from the more advanced Microsoft project are gonna be pulled over to Microsoft Planner to make it a much more advanced project management system. Now, it looks like there's gonna be two versions of the new Planner. There'll be a basic version, which will be included within your Microsoft 365. But there'll also be a premium version, which as the name implies, will probably incur an extra cost. The premium version has all the premium features. It'll have Copilot, which is AI. I want we'll to talk about that in a moment. But it'll also have some advanced project management features, like timelines, where you can easily visualize your project, you can create dependencies on certain tasks, and much more. In short, this new planner is gonna be a fully functional, feature-rich project management system. And of course, no new technology release would be complete without the integration of AI. Now, Microsoft's AI is obviously called Copilot, and that's gonna be included in the premium version of Planner. So what will Copilot be able to do for your business? Well, think of Copilot as your very own digital assistant. 
So you want to plan a new product launch and you're thinking, what steps do I need for a successful product launch? Well, why don't you ask Copilot? And Copilot will provide a list of all the tasks you need to successfully launch your product. And you can then take control. You can change those tasks around. You can add more, or you can go back to Copilot and ask them to do it for you. Copilot will also analyze the goals you've set for your project, and it will cater the tasks according to your goals. It's all very clever. So I cannot wait until the new Planner app is released in 2024. Microsoft have put a ton of videos on YouTube all about the features. Check them out. I look forward to seeing you again soon.